One of the things we love to celebrate is ability. We love to celebrate those who contribute to the good of our society. Doctors, academics, emergency services personnel, especially sports people. But when it comes to people with disabilities, they are too often seen as weak, needy, valueless, and a burden for others to look after. Too often, disability is seen as not worth celebrating, to be minimised, perhaps even to be avoided. When this kind of thinking enters the church, not only does it cause problems for people who have disabilities, it causes problems for the whole church as it faces the very real prospect of missing out on God's work. The Bible teaches that God is sovereign over disability and demonstrates his grace through the weak things of the world rather than the strong and capable. After all, the greatest demonstration of God's grace was when Jesus died by the weakness and shame of the cross to save those least deserving and least capable, sinners. If God demonstrated his grace in this way, then we can expect God continues to demonstrate his grace through those things we may consider weak and valueless, including disability. So, how do we begin to think biblically about disability? How do we relate to people with disabilities? How do we welcome them into the church and celebrate what God celebrates? These are some of the issues being discussed at the Disability 101 workshop. Make a note of it, stick it in your diary, mark it on your calendar, and come along. Be part of a conversation. Be informed, be encouraged, and be inspired.